Welcome to this video about the best registry cleaner program. Now, I'm really going to keep this really quick, just a few minutes long, but I'm basically going to try and show you um, this registry cleaner tool called Frontline Registry Cleaner. Now you've probably heard a lot about registry tools on the internet and you may have even encountered some of the dodgy ones that are out there. The best registry cleaner is the program that's able to fix the largest number of errors on your PC in the most effective way. Obviously there are going to be some which do this very well and some which don't. Just a bit of insider information here. Um, most of the registry cleaners on the internet are actually designed by amateur developers um, basically because they want to add products to, to their portfolio so then their further clients will then see that they've made a program like a registry cleaner. Essentially these programs they make aren't very good and it takes a program like this, like a professionally designed tool to actually make sure that your PC is working properly. Now what I want to do uh, is point out various different features of this and show you how well it scans as well. The first thing you need to notice is that it's designed and published by a company called Frontline PC Utilities. Now this company is a, is a UK based pr uh, software firm. I've actually had the pleasure of meeting them in person and essentially what they've done is actually branded the product. That's important because it means that they actually value the quality of the program and they're confident that you're going to like it. So obviously they want you to come back for more with, with their name and stuff. So having that name is important. If many of the registry tools out there are, to, are published by these unknown developers, you do not want to go near them. You want to stick with the, what, uh, Frontline or the likes of PC Tools or some other program which has got a big company behind it. Okay, so onto the scanning facility as well. Um, actually, just before that, you'll see the UI, the user interface of this program is actually very, it definitely unique, and you can see that the buttons and the various tick boxes are very easy to use, especially if you're you know, not too confident with PCs, all you need to do is click on the button and it will, you know, obviously um, change its status there. So what I'm going to do now is just click start scan and this is where this cleaner really wins out. As you can see, the number of errors it's finding is a lot, plus the speed at which it's scanning and finding them is just incredible. You'll find most registry cleaners and again, these will be the ones designed by amateur coders will not be able to find number one a lot of errors and number two a lot of um, errors quickly. And as you can see, this tool is able to find over a thousand errors on this PC and over 300 megabytes of junk files. Now, just to put this in a bit of perspective, this cleaner is basically um, running on a PC that's extremely clean and is able has been clean um, several months before, and, and, and obviously is very um, up to date. If you're using this on a, a quite an old system, then obviously you'll have a lot more errors and a lot more junk files so if that's just something to bear in mind this PC is actually pretty new actually so uh, in terms of the errors it's found it's found 13 16 uninstalled entries um, 9 empty register keys 6 file associations and a bunch of different temp files and junk files and stuff um, an important thing you might want to know about this is that not only does it find registry errors but it also gets rid of Windows temporary files and system files and this basically means that um, any kind of file that might be taking up spa unnecessary space inside Windows, it can get rid of it with the click of a button. Now obviously you might want to do that, but it's up to you. I personally love it because um, it's a brilliant little feature. So, okay, so I've organized the tabs now and basically as you can see, um, these are all the tab, the, the what the erroneous uh, categories and I've unticked any of the junk file ones so as you can see it says zero junk files are going to be selected for removal I've selected all the potential errors that we've got on this system just to give you an example of how well this tool cleans now this is really the reason why it's the best registry cleaner in my eyes I'm going to click fix errors now and because we're registered of course um, it's able to fix them um, as you can see here it's gone through and it's fixed the various errors that are on there Actually, it's got temporary files that's fixed as well, but that's no big deal. Essentially, what I'm going to do now is show you how the cleaner reacts to that. Now, any good cleaner which is actually able to do what it says on the tin will not find any, if or many, or, or any errors on this system now. And any of the rubbish or poor quality cleaners will actually find a lot of errors. So let's, let's run this tool and see what happens. And as you can see, it's found six errors as opposed to 1,000 and what 500 or something before. It's a big, big leap. Obviously, we clean up the, the temporary files we left the others, and that's also gone down considerably. So, the bottom line here is this cleaner actually does work to clean the errors that it that it's found. Obviously, the errors it finds 
um, we need to make sure that they're ones which are you know going to impact the, the performance of your system but of course there's no doubt that this is able to find and fix the errors that your system's got now have you just noticed then that I actually updated the backup there and as a consequence I'm just showing you now that the cleaner is able to find the errors again that um, the backup held now this basically means that um, the cleaner is able to find and fix the same number of errors over and over again considering the backup still there and that is a sign of a quality product because it means that the, that the engine is sound and robust and it's able to find the same errors. What you'll find with a lot of the poor quality tools is they'll find like 700 errors one time and then 300 the next time. Even if you don't clean it, they'll still differentiate the, the number of errors that your system can have. That's a big problem because it means that the it will be missing errors, it won't be finding the ones that your PC might have and generally it's just a waste of time. This program, if you're looking for a registry cleaner, is by far the best. And of course, it's got the likes of a startup manager, junk file remover, registry defragments, um, program, backup feature, and just generalized. It, it generally it's one of those high quality tools that we've actually used. Um, now, all that's left for me to say is that you can actually get a free trial of this. You do have to pay to use it properly. I mean, we've registered the copy, and it costs us twenty nine ninety nine US dollars to register. Um, you can actually get a free trial of run of the program which basically lets you scan your system see how many errors you've got and then it'll um, prompt you to either register or obviously if you want to uninstall it you can um, it's a totally safe program and we rate it extremely highly we've used many different registry tools and this is by far the best you can download it from the link down here or from the link in our video description so thanks for watching and I really do hope this has helped you out